What's up, guys? Welcome back to CoinFlow TV. This is Rav. Got some updates for you today on BitConnect X and the ICO that's going to be launching here in about five and a half hours. Got some good news and I got some bad news. We'll talk about that as soon as I get back. Zombie Apocalypse. <laughs> Alright guys, as usual, before we get started, I'd like you to pause this video if possible and read over the few things I'd like you to remember before watching this video. Thanks. Alright everybody, welcome back. Thanks once again for tuning in and uh, before I get this video started, I just want to let you know that if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button now down below. Also, there's a little bell icon there that'll turn on post notifications for my show and I'll let you know every time I post a video make sure to hit that thumbs up button as well if you like the video if you don't drop a comment let me know what it is about it that you don't like and uh, we can work on getting it fixed or you know anything moving forward so uh, big conversation the big topic of the day is BitConnect X we've been waiting a while for this we did see it pop up uh, you know I think right around New Year and everybody's wondering what the heck it is um, as you can see on the screen here, it starts in five hours and 34 minutes. Now, big question up until now is what the heck is BitConnect X? So I think we got some answers. I managed to get on their FAQ page here. Um, you know, if you uh, go to bitconnectx.co forward slash FAQs uh, forward slash. Um, and I tried that on all of these here. I tried it on home about, well, home just takes you back to the home page about statistics features downloads i tried on all those and it just says page not found so managed to get on the faqs page here so let's talk a little bit about it um some answers here and uh, like i said some good news and some bad news uh what is the ico price of bitconnect x bitconnect x will be offered at the rate of five dollars per bccx over the 45 day ico period there will be two bonus levels as follows five percent bonus from January 10th to January 24th, 2% bonus from January 25th to February 8th, and no bonus from February 9th onward. So $5 a coin, guys. And I mean, you know, that is very, very high in comparison to other ICOs, especially other lending ICOs, but it is BitConnect. And I think that, um, you know, that's obviously why the price is, uh, is up there like that. Uh, 45 days the ICO period is gonna be going on so if you guys remember yesterday I was talking about that interview with the promoters from the Netherlands they did say everybody's gonna have an equal opportunity um, to participate in the ICO launch all right uh, where can I participate in the ICO if you are already a registered member of bitconnect.co you can log in into bitconnectx.co website and place buy order with available option. If you're new to the community, you can register in either bitconnect.co or bitconnectx.co to participate in the ICO. So if you already signed up in Bitconnect, once again, my referral link is down in the description below. If you haven't, you can go ahead and sign up, um, get yourself going in Bitconnect, and uh, you'll be able to log into this Bitconnect X site using that, or you can go directly to the Bitconnect X site and log in and create an account if you don't have one, all right? What is the maximum supply of BitConnect X? Uh, the maximum supply of coins will be 49 million. 11.7 uh, million coins will be available to buy in the ICO and 2.9 million coins uh, held by BitConnect as reserve fund. The remaining 35 million coins will be available through POS and POW mining. Uh, how long will the ICO last? The ICO will start from January 10th, 2018 and run until February 23rd, 2018. What currencies will be accepted? We talked about this before. We will accept Bitcoin, Litecoin, and BitConnect coin only for the ICO purchase. So, and you guys, you know, if you have some money staked in the BitConnect coin, or if you're holding BitConnect coin in your BitConnect, uh, BitConnect wallet, um, you know, that'll probably be the easiest and fastest way to get your money sent over to BitConnect X, unless it's already showing there. Um, second fastest is going to be Litecoin and cheapest probably. And then we all know what's been going on with Bitcoin lately. The blockchain is just kind of like slow down. Uh, fees are really expensive. So, uh, those two, if you have BitConnect or Litecoin, I probably would say that those are going to be the easiest way to get into this. Uh, what can I do with my BitConnect X? So this is the big question, guys. What, what type of program is this? Uh, BitConnect X will use POW and POS algorithms to secure the blockchain network, enabling both miners and stakeholders to earn interest 
in the form of transaction fees or mining rewards. Um, so kind of looks like the same thing, you know, you're staking or you're, you're putting into it and you know, you have the ability to mine and, and earn money that way. Uh, what will happen to the BitConnect X not sold during the ICO? The unsold coins will be, or will go to reserve funds for marketing development and administrative work. Which wallet should I use to store BitConnect X? You can use web wallet on BitConnectX.co. Uh, website or web wallet offered by third-party ser service providers. You can also store in QT wallet once it is available as per our 2018 roadmap. Here's the bad news, guys. Now, I don't know. You guys take this how you want to take it and uh, make your decision based off of, you know, I guess, what you know here and what you see on the site when it goes live once again in about five and a half hours. Um, I'm probably not going to kill myself to wake up at four o'clock in the morning because I know this ICO is going on for 45 days. And again, the price is going to be the same for a little while. Um, this ICO is not open to us citizens or residents distribution. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't put a space there. Uh, this ICO is not open to the U S to U S residents or, re um, to U S citizens or residents. Distribution is therefore not offered by this website to U.S. citizens or U.S. residents. By participating, you hereby agree and commit that you are not a U.S. citizen or U.S. resident. So that's the bad news, guys. Uh, again, I don't know that's how, how that's going to work out. I mean, obviously, that's something new that a lot of these ICOs are going through. And it's the uh, main reason behind that is because the SEC um, in the United States here has stepped in and um, have started dropping the hammer on these ICOs or you know these companies that are doing crowdfunding, uh, mainly in the ones that are offering, you know, saying, hey, this is a great investment. You can earn a lot of money by investing in our ICO, whether it's a lending platform or some time or some type of investment platform. Um, I know that they're not really um, harassing if you want to use that word or coming down hard on the ones that are offering their token as a crowd sale for an actual utility so like utility tokens um those are tokens that serve a purpose and are being created to serve a purpose um like a change in the blockchain or even you know something else where they're not necessarily considering it as an investment and saying hey if you buy our ico you can make tons of money and that kind of stuff you'll start noticing that on a lot of the lending platforms um, they are now saying that they're not really, you know, um, open to U.S. citizens, and it's because of the SEC. Um, so that kind of sucks for us. Like I said, take it the way you want to take it. Obviously, if you're a chance taker, you take a chance. I'm not sure what they're going to be doing to shut down investments from the United States, but, you know, I guess we'll we'll see. Um, it's definitely an ICO that a lot of people are looking forward to, and, you know, a lot of people don't want to miss out on, including myself. And, uh, you know, you see the income potential with the actual BitConnect token going to, you know, breaking $400 in less than a year per coin. So um, let's move on to the next question. Here. It says, will you pay for the bounty program? No, we will not offer bounty program as we already have dedicated community for our ICO awareness and marketing. Here's another one. Is there a minimum, any minimum or maximum purchase limit in the ICO? Yes, you can only purchase 100 BCCX per 24 hour time frame. So remember guys, you're only going to be able to purchase uh, 100 BCC a day. That's the maximum at $5, you know, per coin, that's $500 a day. So it's still, you know, kind of like how you would go into the other ICOs, but there you have it, guys. There's the FAQs. There's some answers for you guys. I know a lot of people have been kind of sitting around waiting, twiddling their thumbs, waiting for BitConnect to drop some news on this stuff. And um, I kind of had to do some digging to find this. I've been messing around all day with the, um, you know, with those tabs and just putting in the forward slashes. And it wasn't working earlier, but it's working now, which says FAQ. So hopefully that answers some of your questions. Um, it's kind of sucky news for us in the United States. But we'll see what happens. I mean, obviously, the day that it hits the exchange, you'll be able to purchase at that time because it's not necessarily an ICO anymore. It's just us, you know, voluntarily uh, purchasing the coins. And, you know, hopefully it's at a, still at a good price for us. So uh, let's go back here real quick. Um, ICO price. So it will be offered at a rate of $5. And I'm wondering if that $5 stays the price throughout the term until the 23rd or the 45 day ICO period. I'm not sure it doesn't say anything else about that. It just talks about bonus, you know, 5% from January 10th 
to January 24th. Uh, and then 2% from the 25th to the 8th, and no bonus from February 9th onwards. Um, so once again, there's your answers, guys. Hopefully that helped you out a little bit. If you have any questions or if you have any comments or know something that I don't know or I haven't heard yet, please drop that in the comment section below. Another thing I want to talk to you guys about is be aware of scams, guys. Scams pop up, and you know we saw when Laser went down, they were redirecting it to BitConnect site, and then there was a bunch of scams that pop up on uh, Telegram promising people that they can get their money back. There's actually a, a one going on right now with NeoConnect because uh, last night, if you guys watch my videos, you'll see that the NeoConnect site has been down and they haven't been updating their um, their social media or their Telegram since December 27th. A lot of people are pissed off and, uh, you know, it looks like NeoConnect has pulled an exit uh, scam on us. Um, and if they didn't, then, you know, prove, prove otherwise, guys. You know, if you're watching this video or if you see this video, I'll prove to these people that you're not exiting on them. A lot of people are pissed and you guys are just not answering. Either way, there's people popping up on their Facebook uh, comments and uh, basically saying, hey, this is NeoConnect. Um, we can help you get your tokens unlocked or we can help you get your money back from the ICO. Uh, private messages. Anytime somebody says to private message them, guys, or you know anything like that, more than likely it's a scam unless it's the actual support for an up and running platform that there's no issues with. But if you got a ton of people pissed off on your Facebook or on your social media or wherever it is and you're telling them to private message you it's a scam and unfortunately there's some people out there that fall for that kind of stuff so you know and I feel really bad and I feel really sorry because there's people that are I don't want to say gullible but you know they just fall for that stuff because they really put their trust in these platforms guys everything we do when it comes to cryptocurrency is completely based off speculation this stuff is extremely high risk and I can't stress, I say it in all my videos, I have a, you know, something that pops up in the beginning of my video that says, don't ever invest more than you can afford to lose. And I really, really, really mean that. Um, you know, there's a lot of people out there trying to take advantage of good people like me and you. Another thing is a lot of people get mad at YouTubers because we post about these programs. We talk about lending platforms. We talk about passive income. Mm -hmm. And a lot of us, you know, we get our, we get thumbs downs on our videos and stuff like that. But if you really look at it, we're the ones that bring you the news. You know, if you don't, sometimes if you don't turn on YouTube and you pull up a site like this one, for instance, mm -hmm. BitConnect X, you see it says it on the top, BitConnect X, and I'll be a part of the cryptocurrency movement. And a lot of people probably went to this site and it says the BitConnect ICO is finally here. Register and become one of the first investors. Join now. And it has this little contribute tab down there making it look like, and it, it says ICO ends in 24 days. You hit that button, it's going to take you someplace, ask you to log in, probably even going to ask you for your BitConnect login. So now they have access to your BitConnect dashboard and, you know, and they can transfer your funds out and do what they want to do with it. But it's probably going to ask you to send them money as well. You know, so you're going to be sending money to their um, to their wallet. And this is a scam all day, guys. So these are the type of things that you have to be careful of. If you come across this in a link or somebody has it you know, posted on Telegram or, or uh, Facebook or Twitter or whatever it is, it's xbitconnect.co. It's a scam site. And if any of you have already lost money in this, guys, you know, I feel bad for you, but you got to be aware of these things. The actual BitConnect site is bitconnectx.co. So very important, all right? I just wanted to bring that to your attention. If you didn't know or if you came across the site, do not contribute in it. It is looking like it's a scam, and obviously we know it doesn't have anything to do with the BitConnect X website. Speaking of BitConnect, let's talk about our BitConnect. What do we got going on, guys? I mean, making some money. We're up to $1,200 uh, so far in total investments. Uh, that's our active investment. So far, no capital release. I've been on this program since October 13th, which is about three months, almost three months ago, and uh, so far I've earned over a thousand bucks. So in three months, I've earned over a thousand bucks. I started with a one hundred dollar loan, added another two hundred, and then add another four hundred. So in total, out of my own money, I've placed four hundred dollars into this uh, program or this platform, BitConnect, and I've earned back a thousand dollars in three months. I mean, honest, obviously, if I would have invested, you know, a thousand to start or five thousand or whatever, um, I would have earned a lot more by now. But it's so far, it's a phenomenal program. They have a new ICO coming out. And uh, they're paying out. A lot of people are making money. I haven't really been reinvesting for the last week because I've been trying to put whatever I've been making in my lending wallet back into the BitConnect wallet, thinking that I was going to be able to participate in this ICO. I didn't know what the price was going to be at first. So obviously, 
you know, that would have been a uh, shot in the dark right there. And then now I've come to find out that I can't participate from the U.S. So, like I said, man, we'll figure it out. But uh, BitConnect, I do have my referral link down in the description below. I'm trying to grow my BitConnect team. Um, I do from time to time do contests and giveaways for the people that are signed up under me. Um, and I'm going to start doing some more whether or not you're actually invested under me. As long as you're signed up under me, I'm going to start doing some more um you know, uh, giveaways, loan giveaways, things like that, advertisement time. i just been, like I said, for the last couple of days, I've been trying to set up all my new equipment. And uh, thanks for the support. Whoever, you, Whichever one of you guys uh, commented on my um, video last night saying that you know, video quality was better, sound quality is better. I really appreciate that. I think Lloyd Zeus was one of those guys. Shout out to you, man. You've been a supporter for a very long time. The rest of you guys, if you're just tuning into my channel for the first time, if you like what you see, please go ahead and once again hit that subscribe button down below. Hit that thumbs up button. Drop a comment. Uh, feel free to message me if you have any questions or anything like that. But that's all I got for this show, guys. I'll see you tomorrow where we're uh, going to talk about capital expense. Remember, that next ICO launch is in 22 hours. It starts in 22 hours. That'll be about 8 o'clock p.m. tomorrow, Eastern Standard Time. They did announce that they're going to be doing $0.25 cents for their first round of ICO with a maximum token purchase of 300 tokens as well. All right, guys, that's it for this show, man. I'll see you next time. The truth.